So I was visiting Himalaya for two years ago, and I had uh, I had to meet uh, Vinny Rod, which is one of uh, the therapeuts here, which is playing the singing ball, Indian singing, in Tibetan in singing ball, um, as a treatment. And I got this treatment two times. I got so um, I got so inspired by it. Uh, so I invited Vinny to come home to me <laughs> for two weeks and uh, learn me how to play this Indian Tibetan singing ball. Uh, when I've been learning that, I, I, I start to work with it in a different ways. I didn't want to be a therapeut. I'm an artist, so I want to use it in my art. So I did several works, but one was I was really inspired about the frequency, which is so high that, that it, uh, of course, touched your body a lot. But if you also put water inside and you hit it, the singing ball, or you actually drive around it like this, then the frequency gets so high that the, that the ball and the surface of the, uh, the surface of the water or the color get so high that it just starts to jump, as a jump out of the ball. And that was a big inspiration for me, so I, I did the first painting like that. I did several workshops, actually to give people the possibility to create their own painting. Uh, and what's happening is that, that there is only these three materials. There are, there are the paper, there's a singing ball, um, and there's how you hit it. And uh, it's really interesting to see how it reflects completely the person who's doing it. So if you have a really uh, sensitive, um, maybe not that loud person, you will see the painting. And if you have a, uh, someone who has a lot of energy and showing it, they will hit really hard and it will splash all over. So it's really nice to see how, uh, how, this, how, say, how this painting reflects who the people are. Uh, so for me, to coming back to Kamalaya, I ask again, uh, the inspiration start uh, somehow here for two years ago and I said to them, uh, why do I do this workshop to try to give them uh, for free for, for experience. And what happened the last couple of weeks is of course to see uh, how people work with the things and coming up again and some people sitting there uh, one or two hours here in the heating and sweating a lot and they're just sitting there and meditate and they're almost not jumping out, they're just looking at this ball, uh, really beautiful painting almost coming uh, really slowly.